None can foresee the sinister ripple effects of one man's unwavering faith. This is the story of Chantalia, the Firstborn's Covenant, the curse of Jetri's generation. Once upon a time in the land of Amrokadam lived the humble household of Jetri where peace seemed eternal, but shadows loomed. Jetri, a perfect man of God and loving husband to Zaruna, happily married for 45 years, who has always wanted a male child, loved his wife like Christ and was happy even though she couldn't have a child and people mocked him. But the devil? Displeased with Jetri's unwavering faith, regardless of the spirits that has bound Zaruna's womb from her past abortion before she was married to Jetri and her current sins. He has sent seductive spirits to tempt him in adultery, but instead of fornicating, Jetri counted it joy and loved his wife. Satan was furious and begged God to touch his life and if not drain him of peace. He didn't want it to harm nobody else in the family but Jetri, but he could not harm him directly. As the Lord commanded he that abide in my words, let no harm come upon him. Let his seed be blessed in his generations. Satan then pleaded with God to touch Jetri's peace, with his voice dripping with malice. God, knowing Jetri's faith was unshakable, allowed it, setting the stage for a chilling ordeal. The devil prowled around Jetri's home, seeking for the weak and vulnerable, until he has found wickedness, bitterness and covetousness in Zaruna's heart. Now the door was opened unto him, as he sees her as weakness to Jetri's heart. Zaruna, who was barren for the first forty years of their marriage, bore a girl child called Pania, but was not happy, as it was not in her forty years of prayers, and since she has been bitter with God for five years and had secretly departed the faith in her heart. But God who knew Zaruna and had rejected her sacrifice of 40 years of prayers because of her covetousness, her bitterness, her blasphemy and her worship of her marriage and not him. She cheated on her husband trying to conceive a male child to honor her husband but rather conceive Pania and lied to Jetri that it is his seed and sin greatly against God. What happens next will test the very fabric of Jetri's faith, plunging him into a nightmare as the spirit of depression, unforgiveness and separation put a needle through his flesh. Subscribe to watch more of this story as the curse of Jetri's generation unfolds in chilling detail.